All right, let's simplify the fraction 6 40ths. So what we want to do is find another fraction that's equivalent and has the same value as 6 over 40, but we've simplified it. We've reduced it to its lowest terms. So we need to find a factor that goes into 6 and 40 evenly. So here are the factors for 6 and 40. So I look at the factors for 6 and 40, and I'm trying to find the greatest factor that goes into both numbers here. And the only thing I'm seeing is that 2 goes into 6 and 2 goes into 40. That's our greatest common factor. So we'll divide 6 by 2 and then 40 by 2, and that should give us the simplified fraction for 6 40ths. Let's move this over here. So 6 divided by 2, that's 3. 40 divided by 2, that's 20. So we've simplified 6 40ths down to 3 20ths. You can't reduce this any further. It's in simplest terms. These are equivalent fractions. If you divide 6 by 40 and 3 by 20, you'll get the same value. We've just simplified 6 40ths down to 3 20ths. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.